Martin, um, well, welcome to the Digital Festival. Um, what's your impression of the Digital Festival? Well, I didn't know what to expect when I got here, and this has been great so far. Lots of really good speakers. What advice do you have for digital Switzerland? <laughs> keep innovating, absolutely. Keep thinking about it. Uh, what was the best business decision you ever took in your life? <laughs> it's, a, it's a hard question. I've, I've, uh, I've started three companies in my life. Um, all of them were successful. And maybe the, the best decision was not just to be an employee for somebody else's company. What piece of advice would you give to your younger self <laughs> if you had to do it again? I would say the most important thing would be to be very careful about the people I spend my time with. How do new technologies change private and public mobility? I, I think that there, there are two fronts in which uh, technology is changing mobility. Uh, on, on the one front is just the drive train. This is where my focus has been on changing from internal combustion engines to electric drive. Uh, and I think this is a change that will uh, rather rapidly take over the transportation around the world. The other side of it is the whole autonomous driving uh, portion of things, which I think is uh, still an area we need to continue thinking. Uh, but it has uh, already begun to impact the way we think about the future of mobility. Uh, maybe the mistake being made there is to assume that, that the future of mobility will be cars at all. It may be that there's another form of transportation that makes more sense than having everybody in just a self-driving car still filling the roads with cars. And do we already have um, sort of a, a form that could take the space of the, uh, the, the car? A form of mobility that could take the space of the car. I think there's lots of thinking to be done, but you know, one of the things that's really obvious to as Americans when we come to Europe is to see how well your public transportation works with with rail, uh, with subways, uh, and so forth. And if you think about, if we take that infrastructure and apply, you know, 21st century technology to it, can we do something different in that space instead of on the roads? In which areas should we expect to see innovations? that transforms society or the environment as much as Tesla has? Uh, I, I think that Tesla has only just begun to transform society. I think that the impact of machine learning and artificial intelligence have an opportunity to make a much, much bigger impact on society for the better or for the worse. Which digital uh, development fascinates you the most right now? Uh, fascinates and concerns me, I would say, is, is exactly that. It's machine learning and, uh, and art artificial intelligence and their application in places where they dramatically reduce the availability of, of work.